Let's take a problem on mechanical properties of matter. A simple pendulum made of a bob of mass m and a metallic wire of negligible mass has time period 2 seconds at t is equal to 0. If the temperature of the wire is increased and the corresponding change in its time period is plotted against its temperature, the resulting graph is a slope s. If the coefficient of linear expansion of metal is alpha, then the value of s is so we know that the time period of a pendulum is given by t is equals to 2 pi root over l naught upon g where t is the time period g is the acceleration due to gravity l and l naught is the length of the pendulum Now squaring both sides of the equation we get t square is equals to 4 pi square l naught upon g. Now it is given that t is equals to 2 seconds. Now if the temperature is increased from t to t is equals to 0 then let's say the new length is l which is given by L is equals to L naught into 1 plus alpha delta T where delta T is T minus T naught. Now from the question it is given T naught is T equals to 0 and alpha is the linear expansion coefficient. So we have L is equals to L naught into 1 plus alpha t so the new uh, time period will become t is equals to 2 pi under root l upon g now squaring both sides we get t square is equals to 2 pi whole square l upon g which gives us t square is equals to 4 pi square we substitute the value of l from this equation so l naught into 1 plus alpha t upon g now it's asked to find the slope of the line when a graph of time period versus temperature is plotted to find that we have to differentiate this equation such that on the left hand side we get dt upon cap um, d capital T which is nothing but the slope s so so we differentiate this equation with respect to temperature to get 2t dt upon dt is equals to 4 pi square l naught alpha upon g now 4 pi square l naught g is nothing but t square so we have dt upon dt is equals to t square alpha upon 2t which then comes to be alpha t upon 2 we have made this assumption that the time period t doesn't change very much with temperature so we have assumed that dt is almost equal to 2 seconds throughout the temperature change such that dt upon d capital T is equals to alpha into 2 upon 2 2 gets cancelled with 2 equal to alpha now dt upon d capital T is nothing but s which is the slope so the slope s comes out to be alpha